All right, guys, this is why you want to check every single coin set that you have. Now, these are 1966 SMS special mint set coin sets. Now, they do have a silver half dollar in these sets. However, we are focusing on the Roosevelt dime. Here's an image of a Roosevelt dime SMS what you want to look for is this five, this number five that kind of resembles a five on there, on the cheek, right next to the mouth of Roosevelt. Now, Robert Lawson from CoinOp, if you check out CoinOp here on YouTube, he is the one that discovered this and it is featured in the Cherry Picker's Guide. He's actually the one that told me about it originally, and then my buddy Brian told me about it. So that is an image from the Cherry Picker's Guide, which you can get below this video if you guys would like to get it. Feel free to check it out on Amazon. Now, what we're going to do is we're gonna put this underneath the microscope. We are going to check all these sets and see if we can find one that has that five because they are going for some pretty decent money. Actually, one just sold for $195. Now, we are going to sell these sets on whatnot when we are done searching them, because of course they still have value. So not seeing anything there. Let's get a little further in here just to make sure we don't miss any five there. All right, so that set's good. All right, let's check this one here. It should go pretty quick, but you want to inspect your coins very, very closely. All right, let's see here. Uh, seeing any five on that one. All right, that one's good. Come on, let's find one, man. That would be amazing if we could find one of these. I want to give it just a little, nudge it just a little bit up, just because of the lighting, you never know. And I'm not sure exactly what this is, if it's something with the dye that happened or what but not seeing it there for that one. But we do got plenty of these sets. I actually purchased the coin collection recently. This guy inherited a coin collection from his dad. He's moving out of country and retiring. Whoa. So I don't think that I'm seeing it there. More down here by the mouth. Not seeing it there on that one. All right, let's try another one. Not seeing it there for that one either, unfortunately. Man, if we found one of these though, that would be insane. I don't know if I would sell it as is or if I would take it out and get it graded. Nothing there for that one either. Nothing for that one. Don't see it there for that one either. But I did hear someone sold one of these years ago for $2,500. But uh, a recent listing on eBay, one did sell for $195. So we'll see if we can pull it off here. Nothing there for that one. And these all have not been touched by dealers, these sets that I'm inspecting here because I actually bought these from a guy, like I say, that his dad had these in the original box from 1966, absolutely sealed. This is the box that they were originally shipped in. You can see that metal there, they just don't make boxes like this anymore, of course. So all in the original stuff, which was very cool. And um, yeah, it's never been searched by anybody. So that's always a good thing. We got a better chance at finding something that way. But uh, it's all luck, really, at the end of the day. That's why you got to check. But, you know, in my book, A Guide to Coin Hunting, which is available on couchcollectibles.com, I actually show you things to look for on proof dimes as well, missing the S mint mark. And I show you all the dates to look for on different proof dimes that are missing the S mint mark and like proof sets like this, like regular proof sets where you wanna look for a missing S mint mark that can give your dime a lot, a lot of value. I'm talking they are very, very expensive. But this is something really cool to look for. A little variety, Roosevelt dime, SMS, special mint set, looking for, or that extra, or that five there. I thought we had something there for a second. Maybe not. Nope, nothing there. All right, we got five more sets here. Let me know if you guys have any special mint sets and don't forget if you do come across any to look for this extra five, guys. Nothing there for that one. All right, getting down to the nitty gritty here. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's something with the dye or what that caused that, but it almost reminds me of like, uh, my buddy was saying it almost reminds him of the extra high and low leaf on the Wisconsin quarter from 2004. You know, it's always something to look for as well. You know, I'm not seeing anything noticeable here, guys. 
All right, two more sets here, two more sets. But we're always learning new stuff to look for, you know? It's uh, amazing, you know, something from 1966 is just now being discovered on these coins. So big props to Robert Lawson from CoinOp for finding that. He's always searching for errors and varieties. All right, and this is the last set here. You know what we will do? We will also check out um, our, our 67 sets, maybe in a future video just to see if any of those have it. But that's the last set there, unfortunately. Not finding anything, but it's something to look for, something to add to your list, and if you guys don't have a list. We have a list right here on our coin mats and we've updated them and the dime mats are being released very, very shortly. So watch out for that. Quarter mat, penny mat, half dollar mat, nickel and dimes are on the way. Make sure you guys don't miss out on those. They are available right now on couchcollectibles.com. Hey guys, everyone's asking how they can get my free coin book. Well, here's how you do it. You hit the link in the comments. It takes you over here to Whatnot. You'll see my Whatnot page, got 5,000 followers over there. You click on shop right here on the left side and you scroll down and you can add the book. You go buy it now. You enter your payment and your address information and then you make sure that $15 credit applies for your purchase. That way you get the book for free, zero dollars. All right, now you have to use my invite link to sign up. If you guys download the app and sign up, it's not going to work. You have to use the link in the comments. That way you guys can get the book absolutely free. By the way, we are on Whatnot every Tuesday and Thursday doing free giveaways, all kinds of cool stuff over there. We're selling an enormous amount of penny rolls, wheat penny rolls, silver coins, gold coins, everything. Make sure you guys follow. You do not want to miss out on these giveaways.